today's topic is opposition training for police service dogs. So let's get right to it. As I pointed out in the first segment of the video, what I mean by opposition training is making it difficult for the dog to engage. In French ring, they do this by means of a skeeves. These are quick movements by the decoy to make the dog miss and consequently work harder to get the bite. In KMPV and IPO, the dogs always know how the decoy or the helper is going to act. For police canines and personal protection dogs, it is important for them to learn that not everybody is going to cooperate, as it were, and make it easy for them to get in there and bite. When training these dogs, I like to use a combination of blocking techniques uh, with different objects, as well as some evasive movements to force the dog to show that they have the desire, the drive, and the self-confidence to stay with it and get in there and get the job done. If you don't do this in your training, you're only kidding yourself. Now I'm going to demonstrate this with a local police service dog that I'm pretty familiar with. Uh, I'll get right back to you after these two short video clips, and then we'll discuss what we've seen. Okay? Here we go. Okay, my friends, here you see two runs we made in an empty warehouse with Brody. I used a narrow hallway so he could only come through the opposition I was putting against him. When you introduce this into your training program, you need to treat each dog as an individual. Some dogs will not be phased by this at all, while others will need a little help and encouragement to get used to it and then ignore it. It is simply a matter of conditioning. Not every officer is going to get a dog who is a natural street sweeper. I start with a little opposition and increase the intensity as the dog gets better at it. The dog must be successful and not defeated in these drills. If necessary, the handler needs to help out a little. I've tried this on dogs with many apprehensions but no exposure to this type of training and stopped several of them without a whole lot of effort. The dog in this video is a veteran patrol dog who couldn't care less about what you throw at him or how you try to block him. Despite being a very social dog in public, when it comes to work he is all business and will eat your ass for breakfast. So get out there and do some opposition training. Final thought. Police canine training is not a sport. We are not competing for points here. I don't care about a calm, full grip. I don't care about a super clean, robot-like out. This is the real deal. Police canine training and deployment is combat. It's the good guys against the bad guys. When the shit hits the fan, you need to be ready. So get out there and train. And stay thirsty, my friends. Until next time. Thanks for watching.